Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little bit of this and that. I'm just going to be kind of running around my house and just kind of getting caught up and getting things done. So it's not going to be any type of like crazy extreme or deep clean or anything like that. It's just going to be an extremely realistic, relatable cleaning video today. But I just got a grocery order in right now so I thought I would do a little quick haul for you guys. I have gotten some requests for some grocery hauls. So let's go ahead and run through these groceries and then I'll kind of take you around the house with me today and we'll just kind of get caught up on things that need to be done. Okay, so my grocery order just came in. I just did an Instacart delivery with Stater Brothers. I do kind of switch around grocery stores that I shop at depending on what I need. Obviously, I needed a a lot of things so I went ahead and just did my local Stater Brothers so I'm gonna run through this super quick I'm not gonna spend a ton of time but I know again that I've had requests to do some grocery hauls I also love watching hauls so let's go ahead and just run through everything so I got a couple of these frozen meals these are just really easy to throw in the microwave when we're at home we're trying to eat at home more these are Ryland's favorite. These are steam bag um, edamame beans. He loves having these with jasmine rice and chicken teriyaki, which I got today as well. We got some snacking chips here. I was down to one roll of paper towels, so we picked up some of those. Some lettuce for sandwiches, and then I picked up some cucumber to dip in ranch and my everything but the bagel dip that I got from Trader Joe's. I also picked up a tomato to make BLT sandwiches. I picked up the seasoned curly fries, the Arby's brand. I've never gotten these, but they actually looked really good. So we're gonna go ahead and try those out. Um, this is the brand of the barbecue style chicken teriyaki that I love to make for the boys. My husband and I actually eat it too. If you need a really quick dinner idea, this is so good. Um, and then I also picked up some blueberry muffins just for a really easy, quick breakfast on school mornings. And then same with these bagels, we got cinnamon raisin and blueberry. A loaf of bread. This is my favorite bread, you guys. This is so good. If you see this in the store, definitely grab it. It's so soft. It's super yummy. Um, we picked up a carton of eggs and then a couple things of goldfish. We fly through these like crazy in this house. Um, I haven't gotten tuna in a long time and I just kind of was wanting something different for at home lunches. So I picked up some cans of tuna, some of these just crack an egg, um, things for in the morning. I got two of the ultimate scramble and then two of the all American scramble some Cheerios, frozen pancakes, some bacon for in the mornings or for BLT sandwiches. I usually love my Trader Joe's lemon yogurt, but I don't have Instacart for Trader Joe's and I was not able to go to the store today. So I'm gonna try these out and see if they're good. Um, I have ordered these before. These are so yummy. So I went ahead and picked up some of these Tillamook strawberry yogurts. A multi-pack of Nature Valley bars. I love to keep these just for like a grab-and-go snack. A couple things of the uh, Little Bites for the boys. We got chocolate chip muffin and also blueberry. Colton already got into these, but I got these really quickly just for a sweet treat. The boys love these things and so do I. I always grab these for myself too. So it's just a 20 pack of these little cookies and crackers. A huge thing of coffee. Of course, decaf for me. If you guys suffer from anxiety like me, cutting out 
caffeine or just cutting down on caffeine um, helps me tremendously. So I picked up some of my Don Frisco's decaf coffee. And just so you guys know, there is still caffeine in decaf. Yes, I know. Sounds weird, but there totally is. So this has just enough caffeine for me to get up and get moving without giving me full-blown anxiety. I picked up some of these uh, cheeseburger sliders for the boys. I love doing these. Just as a really quick dinner for the boys. And then we'll hop around and I'll show you what I got for the other half of the delivery. I wasn't kidding when I said this was a large haul, you guys. So we're still going. I got a couple of these pizzas. This isn't actually the brand I picked out, but they were sold out of the other one. And so I figured we would go ahead and substitute with these and give them a shot. They look really good. Um, a thing of apple juice. I do water this down for the boys. I usually do like half water, half apple juice with ice. Some of the Honest Kids um, juice boxes. A thing of the low sodium soy sauce. We got some relish for the tuna sandwiches and our favorite syrup. We got some bananas, some baby carrots, almond milk, a big thing of orange juice. We go through this like every few days. A big thing of the Dove coffee creamer. My husband really likes this one. This one I grabbed for me, good old pumpkin spice, tis the season, ladies. And then I got a cafe mocha creamer as well. So that is my grocery haul for today. I don't need no one to say you're complicated. Cause I knew from the start this might be overrated.
it. I just ordered this off walmart.com literally the day before yesterday, I think it was. Wow, they're really gonna make me work to get into this box. Um, and I got a notification that something was on my porch. So I check it, I'm pretty sure I know what this is. But like I said, I ordered this literally the day before yesterday and it's here. So I wanna show you guys, yep, it's what I thought. Okay, I wanna show you guys what I ordered. These are from walmart.com. I follow Laura Beverlyn on Instagram. I know lots of you guys probably do too. She is amazing. And she linked these and I could not believe how cute these were and from Walmart. So I wanna show you guys, I'm gonna unbox these for you. Look how cute these are. I will link them below for you guys. Again, these are from Walmart. Um, these are originally $24.98 and I think I got them less than that. I'll have to double check, but I wanna say they were less than $20 because they were on sale. They might have even been around like 18 bucks or something. Don't quote me, but like I said, I'll link them below for you guys. I think they had other colors too, but I just wanted to share these with you guys in case you needed some fall boots. I have a pair very similar to this in black, so I definitely needed a pair of brown. So I'll try them on and hopefully they say that they're true to size. So I guess we'll find out. So I think I'm gonna try these on really quickly, but just wanted to share. Sharing some things that I got on Amazon and Walmart and Target. I've been sharing all kinds of things with you guys. I verified the boots and they were $24.98 for some reason. I probably got them confused with another pair of shoes that I was looking at because they had a really cute pair of sneakers for like $18, which I think I might go back on and grab. But either way, less than $25 for a pair of boots like that is so good. Um, I also ordered a three pack of leggings that so haven't come in yet. And then um, like a, it says a chunky knitted pullover baggy turtleneck type sweater. So when that comes, I will share with you guys. But I wanted to show you guys, I got these bats last year for Halloween to decorate my entryway. Um, if you guys follow me over on Instagram, then you guys saw that. But these bats are so popular. Again, I will link these down below in the description box. But here are the little bats that I got. Let me see if I can get this to focus in for you guys. But see how they kind of like, fly up the wall so i'll be doing that in my entryway so these just came in from amazon today and then i'm expecting some um under the cabinet like little puck lights for my kitchen today i ordered those from target.com they're remote controlled um so when those come in if i'm still filming i'll install those on this video because i really 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 i'm excited about those and i want to share those with you guys so I usually don't chit chat this much in my videos. But like I said, this video is like totally different. So I hope you guys don't mind me sharing this stuff with you. Let me know down below if you guys like when I stop and share this stuff with you. But for now, let's just go ahead and keep moving because I'm getting easily distracted by like everything. <laughs> So my puck lights that I ordered from Target.com arrived, so I'm going to go ahead and stop what I'm doing to install these really quickly. This came with a set of six and then it came with some screws or the option to just use the 3M strips to easily hang them up under your cabinet. So that's what I'm going to use today. These also came with the batteries already installed so I don't have to fiddle around with any of that. So I'm going to go ahead and install these really quickly because I'm really excited and then I will show you guys what they look like afterwards.
I just love how these came out. These are so cool. So it came with a remote so I can turn them on and off with the remote. It even has a dimmer on there and a timer. So I think that these are so cool. Um, I didn't want to rip into my backsplash to wire in the under cabinet lighting. So these worked out perfectly. So this is the next day and the boys were doing some of their virtual homeschooling and their bathroom is just right there. So I figured I could kind of get some stuff done and multitask while they were on their calls with their teachers. And of course their bathrooms are always a disaster. So I'm going to come in here and wipe down their mirrors, their vanity, clean up their toilet and their bathtub. quickly hop on and just thank you guys for supporting my channel just yesterday I hit 5,000 subscribers here on my channel and I am just like blown away by how supportive and your guys's kindness you guys have shown me here on my channel I must say it is extremely rare that I get any negativity on here and it could be really really hard putting yourself out there here on YouTube and I know there's a lot of people out there that can say some not kind things but that is definitely not the case for my channel so I just want to thank you guys so much for all of your support and always being so kind.
As I'm editing this, I'm kind of multitasking because we're actually getting ready to head out of town and go to the river camping for the next few days. So I really wanted to get ahead and make sure I didn't miss any of my uploads for you guys. So I hope you guys are really enjoying this video. Actually, we will be back the day that this goes live. So I will probably be, be over on my Instagram sharing some photos and whatnot of our trip. So if you guys want to see any of that, I'll go ahead and leave my Instagram handle here on the screen. One thing that I love to do when I have to sit down and fold laundry is turn on the TV and watch a show. It just seems like it's a little less painful to sit down and fold and hang laundry and sort through things when you have a little bit of entertainment. So comment below and let me know if you guys do this too. Do you guys throw on Netflix or one of your favorite shows while you fold laundry? Another fun find that I wanted, really wanted to share with you guys were these really pretty candlesticks that I got off of Amazon. Again, I will link them down below. They were super cheap and it came with this set of three and I've been wanting a set like this for a while and just haven't been able to find a set in store. So I went ahead and ordered these on Amazon Prime and I'm gonna go ahead and light them just to melt the candles down so they look a little bit more rustic. But as always, please always supervise your candles when doing this, especially when it's under a shelf or close to a wall like this. One point I would never thought that I would meet someone like you. This time it's all different. You got every little string on me. The way you make me feel is crazy. How did you get so fly? Coming to the end of this video, I wanted to share with you guys a little quick Target haul. I had to run there and get a few cleaning supplies. My spray mop broke, the O Cedar one that I had, and so I went ahead and picked up this one by Infuse. I'm really excited to try it out, so definitely stick around for my future videos to see my review on this one. I also needed some more of the Clorox toilet wands and some trash bags. Um, I needed to pick up a couple things of makeup and then I even grabbed a new bathing suit for our trip. Um, I also picked up a new book that was recommended to me by a few of my friends. It is the You Are a Badass and I'm currently wrapping up the book Girl Boss. Um, so I'll have to let you guys know how I'm liking those. But thank you so much for watching today's video. I am just always blown away by all of your support. If you guys enjoyed this video, I would love for you to hit that thumbs up button. And also, please do not forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye! Try